This is a serious matter. Then a very, very serious matter. Exactly. If it was a taxi man, I get lack of a manslaughter. If it's a bus man, you get lack of a manslaughter. Sugar jar, something wrong with your phone. People eat me by default. <laughs> you know, like that one day. You know, the dogs that people eat for time by default. Anyway, the, the live when we do yesterday with me and Queen Africa, it seems like it hurt some nerves. It seems like it touched some hearts. It seems like it hurt some feelings because yesterday a few gay people, known gay people in Jamaica, took to their social media engine and they have decided to try to bash Twitter hype and try to bash Queen Africa. <laughs> but of course, you know, that has no effect on me because I am merely simply defending what I believe. I am team straight. I am pro straight. I am basically advertising straightness. I am basically endorsing the lifestyle that I believe in. So nothing that these confused individuals say can affect me. So a lot of people telling me, oh, you hear this? I would not hear what they have to say because I do not follow these confused individuals. I do not pay attention to these confused individuals. I do not let these confused individuals drain my energy. I do not pay attention to these confused individuals because they are already in a mental state of depression. They are already in trouble. They are spiritually in trouble, physically in trouble, and mentally in trouble. I am okay with God. I am spiritually grounded. I am physically grounded. I am on a righteous and straight path. Me and the Almighty God are on the same frequencies. So I am not mindful of what these confused, demented, unscrupulous perverted individuals have to say okay so my followers please do not tell me what they are saying about me do not corrupt my thoughts and my mentality with their presence i do not care about them i do not wish to know what they are doing or what they are saying. If I wanted to know what they are doing or saying, I would follow their pages. I do not follow them. I am not interested. No gay person can advise me on how to live, advise me on right and wrong, advise me on what to say or do, or advise me anything on the face of this earth. Because them can't advise themselves. Okay? They cannot even advise themselves. They are so fucking confused. It's like them in a maze. They don't know what they want out of life. Okay? Because first thing we can know, these gay people are very confused. If your gay mission was to succeed, you would not be here on earth. How did you all uh, gay people get here on earth? It's the first question gay people need to ask themselves. That's why you know them so confused. How did you get here? Oh, was it gay activity that got you here on earth? How did you appear on the face of the earth? It was a straight relationship that brought you here. So that's the first point. Of, of madness, for sure, say, on a mad, on a sick in the head. You understand me? I said, that's what, that are the first initial point of confusion. 
where gay people are concerned. Gay people, all you confused beings, ask yourself, how did you get here on earth? How, which channel did you come through to be here? That's the first question. How did you end up on earth? That's all I say now. We don't want to ask them the next three million point, three point add million question. I'm going to ask them now. We can show you so they're my idiot. We just want to ask them the first initial question. How did you get here on earth to even be able to be corrupting the course of nature on earth and to be convincing other people to do the same thing that you're doing on earth from whence you came why you never stay there why you never say i don't want to go to earth since you know that is man or woman having sex would bring you on earth why before you exit to earth you never tell them i don't want to go through that process why you never say God, I don't think man and woman for sex, so I don't want to go through that process. You were brought here through sexual intercourse between a man and a woman. Straightness brought you here. So, how now? Who not go war with me and catch a fit when me say me alright with straightness? Business with you know? Me a defend straightness. We're speaking about straight life, straight right, straight. Maybe if you want to say pride, can only use pride. Somebody want you that straightness, straight life. You understand what I'm saying? So come on now. Get with it, man. Chip chip cherry oh man. Get with it. On a fight, on a fight, I mean a sense. Say so I work for your block, so I'm gonna block you. You've been talking a lot, okay? Yeah. So I'm just simply pushing the straight agenda. That's all me do, you know. So one, I gotta tell me something of the end of straightness. So okay, so let me get this right. Gay people are forcing everybody to be gay. They are. They want rights. To say that they're gay and they want the rights to act gay. They want everybody to accept them as gay. So what if I want everybody to accept me as straight? What if I want to promote my straightness? What if I want to say I am not about that life, I'm about the straight life? Is that a problem? Where some fellow people them? I'll right, block you too. Thank you. Yeah, man, I don't want to bat him on the fire. Lati B, I don't block him already, man. You understand what I say? Yeah. That's all I do. Me want my people to grow in a straight environment. Me want my people to come see straightness. That's all me I say. We don't have a business about who know. Me mama tell them to say, you know, me not busy with them. Everybody cuss me and say, if you love them, let them live them life. So me alone, you know, but me I talk about my straightness. I am straight and I want to promote straightness. I want to spread straightness all over the world. I want my voice to be heard as a voice advocating for straightness. That's what I want. So are you now going to tell me? That a gay person, it's okay for them to openly speak that they are gay. And don't matter who it offend. But a straight person must not speak freely, say them straight, because it's not going to offend gay people. When did gay people become so important? They are not important to me. You 
Yeah, no, you're straight is a problem. If you go out and say, yo, me straight, you know, me not about the business, them say, yeah, often gay people. So why gay people so emotional and so edgy? God go with you know, when you come out and say, when you get hurt me bad, it offend me bad. When me see the butch girl, them, it hurt me bad. When me see faggot uh, uh, and them thing, them, it hurt me bad. It offend me bad. It hurt my feelings. Yeah. When we see gay people, that's eight crime against me. You understand what I say? Gay people don't want to be gay and live them life, you know. They want to be gay and run your life. You don't know, realize that that's the problem, you know. But they might use, but leave the people them alone. Them not leave we alone. If gay people didn't leave straight people alone, you know, and just be gay and stay in them place and do all that, we would not have no problem with, you know. But when I force it by pity them, when I put it in a school, when I put it on TV, when I put it on radio, when I put it in a dance hall video, when I, no, brother, who not trouble we? Who not trouble we? When nobody not trouble, you know? Look how much time, when they are mall and be a place and nobody not said to you know? But no, no, I force this to them in the mall to put up rainbow, when I force this to them to Put up gay thing. Oh, no, no dog, we're not trouble straight people, man. We're not trouble straight people, my lad. We're not trouble straight people. Remember, we don't want trouble, we don't have a down. But when you never come tell me now, say, my three year old son or so, if him feel like him a girl, Oh no, want me as a parent to tell him, say, yes, it's okay to be a girl. Then you not overdo it, you not cross the line. You not cross the line. If you don't want a teacher for inner class, I teach my little son, say, it's okay if you take holding nine bottom. That across the line. That across the line. If you don't want to teach my little son, say, it's okay to kiss Tom. Then, when I cross the line, when not fear teach Pitney them there, low Pitney make Pitney grow and grow big. And if them want to turn lesbian, I bet it, man, when them grow big, when not make them do that. And that depend on them own judgment. But the Pitney them, they've reached 18 yet. Them, they've reached response to them own sin yet. And when want them practice to be batty, man. And if me tell my son, say, yo, go fuck my girl, let me say me a wicked. But only want to tell my son to go fuck a boy and it's okay. Are you fucking crazy? Only crazy, man. Something wrong with you, man. And I talk about, um, we are often gay people. Yeah, we are often, you know, because you are often me. You are often me. So if you don't do any little thing and stay on the little corner of them, uh, uh, he's gonna look at dirty thinking self, uh, full of sin and full of doodle. Then me would not have no problem with you, know? But when I get bright, see the youth now, Mario Lopez, say, him not think it makes sense for a three year old, I said, them decide, say, them want to be gay. Big backlash the man I get, kill him, I want to kill him. Danger, we are at a party. Ah, uh, one one, one one kill Mario Lopez. And uh, him come back now, come retract him statement. Say, um, the speech I make was unreasonable and and uh, what? One bag of something him come say. Team now and lose like a TV show work. And he rich already. <laughs> I should have me. I should have me. But I was tell him got suck out to the mother. I use the money when me have got work my little business or something. Blood clot, you know, can't take on a TV show. We only want to come turn people pick me, you know. We only really want to. Yo, the man apologize and says sorry, and the man that did nothing wrong. He not do nothing wrong, you know. And the man get up and apologize just to money. Just to them, I got fire him off a TV show. I said, brother, you can't do no more work. You can't start a business. You can't broke again, brother. 
My God, man, I saw that, yo. <laughs> yo, you say licky licky. I tell her. Big up your Baba, where your Baba? Mario Lopez, man. He used to come on the dancing show, man. When he would have Jabberwocky and them people, they had danced. The dance show, them. he used to host that. You see me? You see me? He shouldn't apologize. I apologize to what? Because I'm worried about the money where I'm not going to make now. But how much you make already? At this a weakness come in and at this a God test your strength in you know? it. At this a God test your strength in you know? it. When he make them line you have to draw now. When a line draw between if you go turn your back on righteousness and you believe for money. Or you go all out. And improve same feel. Improve same feel. Yeah, music company saved by the belt. Look how long he make money. Look how much money he make. Are you crumbled to that? All he made to tell him, so listen to me. Go and run down your mother, jump in her and splash up your father. That he made to tell him and just cut. Do you understand what I say? She did chapel, cut, left them, and spent 10 years in Africa and come back and still make money. You can't broke again. So how much money you know also? That's when I run God apologize to Batman. How much money you know also? <laughs> Yo, people fool, you know? Can no matter how much money you have, you still don't need more money, you know? Because Babylon set it up so you always need money, you know? All the money you have 200 billion right now, still I try to make more money. Still, every day. Money coming like crack. Money coming like cocaine. I never used to watch you on any um, the one of them at that. I used to watch a dancing show. Wait, name. Um, what I showed the name, man, with the Japanese boy, when he had and then he bring out Shaq and them something there. What did that scene show the name? Yo, people, let me tell you something, man. Let me tell you something about money. See it? No matter how much you have, that get good. Remember, say, people have survived after 10,000 years a year in America. See it? Remember, you know, people have survived after 10,000 US dollars a year. So our man with a hundred million dollar can't tell somebody say, go suck your mother. Me straight and me I got dead straight. Why you can't do that? If you have even one million US, you're good. You can't survive after one million US and live good. Cause you can you have whole little business where you can jump in and it bring in some local money where you make all two thousand dollar a day, two thousand five hundred a day. Where you can buy something done 2,500 a day in terms of food. Remember, you don't have a million, you know. And you set up a business where you make 2,500 a day. Oh, you're broke again. Okay, I'm broke again. You understand? So people just are run down. All right, that's what I come like. Yeah, try catch a breeze for putting our bag. You have your answer. Try catch a breeze for putting our bag. I saw people are run down money. Then look for me. Me never see a million US in my life yet. I may I survive, I may I live good. You see me? I may I survive. I'm a wear good clothes, I may smell fresh and yeah. You know me I say? So oh you have sixteen point eight million and you have to go apologize. Dog, I greedy or greedy. You understand me I say? I greedy and a 
greedy and can't satisfy. I make Batman I use money. I shrink on if you apologize and lose on a soul. Cause Mario come out and say a good thing now. And then him go back and apologize. Lose him, lose him soul, you know. Easy, easy, him lose him soul, you know. Can't enough you apologize not at all. You see me? Oh, you gotta apologize. But you now understand, he's got high expenses, he has a $16.8 million. Your expenses, them can't exceed the money there. You can double into things that will make the money to take care of your bills without you being on TV. And so what if you have to narrow down your expenses for stand up for righteousness? What? So what if you have to live a little cheaper? Say you live in a 20 bedroom house now, Mario Lopez. You can buy a 15 bedroom house. And scale down like a bit, you can't sleep in a 15 bedroom them one time. That are just for people, that are just for people say, oh, um, you're rich. But honestly, that the big house they are fight empty, don't be living in a half fight. You go to upstairs and sleep in your bedroom and the guard now fuck your wife downstairs in our room and you can't hear her. Because the house too big. You understand me, I say? Yeah, simple, cut back on your lifestyle a little bit. Now nah, make no sense. No, nah, I mean, essence bigger. All right, big man thing. For your average family, you don't need more than a two bedroom house, you know. For your average family. Say, yeah, yo, yeah, yo, woman live. I want to get a one youth. You don't need more than a two bedroom house for do what? You have a living room, bathroom, kitchen, bedroom for the child, bedroom for you and the mother, and you have a little, probably, reading area. You have your kitchen, you have one bathroom for the next for the kids' room and one bathroom for your room. You have your car push, your garage or something. You don't need more than that, you know. If you get more people you now, then you'll need bigger house. Because you want each child to have them one room. That 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 makes sense. But what the fuck? You see me? No I makes sense, brother. I will leave a flag over here, man. I mean, them live off, man. Hi, vloggers. How you doing? I know your rent's paid. I know your light bill's paid. I know your car note is paid. All because of me. Have some respect. Okay? I who near Richie Lee? Why everybody in Richie Lee are? I walk on. Uh, why, why, why Richie Lee and everybody are why? Yeah, yeah, you might want a guest room, but I'm saying, for the average family, you don't must want a guest room. People come here and go on back. A guest room is not a necessity, you know. A guest room is, is for people who, where people come sleep over them yard and thing. But I'm talking like, it's a necessity. Like, what you really need. Average family are two bedroom, good. You see me? Also, one of us them deport Jesus. One of us is them deport Jesus. Wanna see that? Well, I make we have a reasoning now. Who don't see them deport Jesus? Anybody see the news where them say them deport Jesus? Who don't see it? See me tell you now, no, no, I go on now. When you see the news of them deport Jesus? No. I'm going to show you. Oh, this Jesus thing is a big lie now. And a long time, them I do it. Two pastors in Kenya, in Alika district in Kenya, decide to say, 
They might go hire the white actor there. Because the man is an actor, right? Fly him in a Kenya. Have him. I drive around now a black Lexus Jeep. I'm telling you. And I collect money for Afrin. And people are paying money for them space in a heaven. Listen, what them appear the man for you now? Them appear the man where it's supposed to be Jesus will return money for them space in a heaven. See? And appear for him a miracle. Two black pastors. I had a white brother who is an actor. Zin, if you come play Jesus. The, the white brother who is an actor also have a church in America too, you know. So, them notice the people love buying to Jesus' story. Them notice they are the biggest lie ever tell upon earth. So, the man, them bring the white boy, the white boy, and I'm robe by everything, tall, hair, and beard. <clears throat> I always tell him, I say, any white man, any white man, grow him ear and grow him beard. A Jesus. A Jesus now, now, now look here now. The, and I like how Silasi image consistent. You know Silasi as the same. Any white man with hair and beard, a Jesus. So, the man, them, the pastor, them thinking of them head and pay the white man for forward down a Kenya. Have him a drive around in our Lexus van. I take the people them money. Zine. And I say, them are work miracle. And also, them are sell spot in our heaven. You hear the man say, madam? You must sell secured spot in our heaven. Now, this is why, this is why I mean, you say, no Christian can talk to me. Because as a Christian, why would you feel the need and the urge to pay money for your spot in heaven? God, God collect money? Well, and God have cash up? God have PayPal? God do wire transfer? That would have like no. God. So as a Christian, you take up your money and appear one human in a flesh. Money to secure your space in a heaven. <laughs> Me pussy clad. Yo, black people are some of the foolish. No disrespect. Yo, disrespect to some black people are some of the foolish bumbo will them pan earth. Pan earth. But really and truly, I said them people they are not true Christian. There are no true Christians. Christianity is nothing for black people. Christianity is a scheme. But tell you, Christianity are the biggest gang pan earth, you know. I want to not listen. I want to not listen. Christianity is a gang, you know, it's a movement, you know. The biggest gang part hurt, you know. Tifa style me? Tifa can't style me. Tifa can't style me. I'm not, me not book for Batman show. Tifa can't style me. This is the part I'm going to get to know. Me not blame the two black pastors them. Me not blame the two black pastors them. You know why? Me not blame the two black pastors them. Because white people have been using the same methods to rob black people for over 500 years. So them should have never locked up the two pastors them. Yeah, yeah, them for deport Jesus, but they must never block up them two pastors. Them not deserve to go to jail, no time at all. None at all. Yes, I do believe in God. What kind of question that they cannot ask me? And I must believe in a God. But me not use Jesus. Me not stupid. Me not say Jesus a fucker. I believe in God. I don't use Jesus. Tifa she has me. Say, how are the D-E there? How are the D-E-M? How are the baby she can have a fat tongue friend? <laughs> yeah. She has first charges. Whoa. 
if I'm going to press charges, sue me for what? <laughs> if I say me that look at Trishy Brown, then a good thing that if me that look at her, what about you that? If I not, yeah, man. Don't worry on there. Um, big man thing, so... If me that look Tifa, that a bad thing? No, hold on, hold on, hold on. For a serious level. If me that look Tifa, that is a bad thing? Seriously? So, I don't know if Tifa style me. <laughs> and I pause, I pause, I somebody call my phone. I want to feel like, come on, only nana sense. Only nana sense. Tifa look good, of course, Tifa cute. With a gear, the dick and straight now, foot them fear. You see me? Wow, what wrong with that? Only must think nothing wrong with that. But what I say is, I am still disappointed that she took that show. All I wish I could say now, now have nothing to do with her, I say. I don't have to be her type, I don't have a problem. Man make you look woman. And woman make you look man. And if a girl don't like you, even if you look her, that's her decision. You understand what I mean? Say? Yeah. No, I think. So look how much woman me look and I get. And look how much woman me look and get. Come on now, like seriously. She is clout. How many of you have she clout? I mean, never said nothing bad about Tifa yet in her life. I would have. I would not chase clout of a Tifa. Tifa not even at right now. But the newspaper front, I see the star. So she would have to go sue the star before she can even sue me. Because I'm clearly having a dialogue based on what's on the front page of the star. You know what I'm saying? Keely, don't ask how much girl refuse me. Ask how much accept me. I just don't choose to, I don't, don't choose to talk. You understand? Me and Tifa cool, you know. She not a choice but for come out and try clap back, you know. But me and her cool. I like, the day before, me see the newspaper, me call her for a booking number and thing, and somebody, me recommend her to somebody for the show and thing. You understand me, I say? You get what me, I say, so? I don't like, Tifa just have to come out and try to defend herself because, between me and you know, people, them, them feel bad about what they do, you know. Them just now say it public, you know, dog. You understand? Them just now say it public, say, say, yo, them feel fuck up cause them go low. So them are going to try to come and clap back and do all of these things and, you know what I'm saying? So, me not even, you notice me not even trace Tifa and her cousin and her go angry with Tifa. She has to come back and try to defend herself. You understand me? I say, but there's nothing to defend. You got low Tifa. And that I just foot her hype. When you know got low, I just tell her, you know, you know, you know, go, she now go and join my life. Come on now. You know she now go and join the life. She now go and deal with what me have to say. Because all of what she has to say, now go make her say, all right, foot her used to look you. All right, foot her want to fuck you. All right, foot her beg your pussy. All right, what else you have to say? Tifa, you look good. Despite your disabilities, you look good. Mouda dick you. Mouda give you crazy khaki. What wrong with that? What could have wrong with that? Yeah, mouda turn your knock knee them in a bow leg. What wrong with that? You understand? Yeah, Tifa, man. Would I hope up your foot and dig out the thing? Um, they would have breathed you too. Make you know, say, a straightness at work. Would have come in your belly and breathe you to Tifa. You a nice little baby so you can help take care of car. It look like you don't know, say, a straightness at work. So, would have breathe you and make you see what straightness bring, make you happy. Make you, make you have real joy. You understand? Show your real happiness. 
איזה מי? So I got me a child tell them. So not we are saying I got hurt me, dog. Not we are saying I got hurt me, Tifa. And come to think of it, did I say Tifa was gay? I didn't say that. I said I was disappointed in her taking the book in. You understand? Yeah. So take me to court for that. Take me to court. And what day did I have this conversation? I had this conversation after you were publicly advertised by the Jamaica Star on the front page for taking a booking for a gay event. So I wasn't lying. Okay? You understand? So, Tifa, big up yourself, Tifa, man. You know, remember say, Tifa, you're not too even to internet. You're not even to follow up internet. You don't even post too often. You see me? You don't even to follow up social media like that. So, you know, really want to take me on this. This is my, my thing. You see me? I'm not even calling him, I just like a block ya. Yeah, chat too much. How can I be define our character with something that was publicly posted on a newspaper front page? Are you dumb? Yeah, me just Vanisha, me just black arm, man. Me just black arm. Me, me don't see what I go on, man. Me black arm already. <laughs> Chew me a man in my dark as they think me not see what I go on, you know. Me never say she gay. Somebody say if she take a booking for a gay event, does that mean she gay? No, but it means that you're in support of it. And dance hall is not in support of that behavior. So, obviously... Yeah, I go against the grid of dance hall. That's what it is. You understand me, I I never said she was gay. Me even go as far as say, my baby mother, live for them lifestyle. Eh? Yanni curvy diva, wind up on girl, on show and go out with a bag of things when she there past stage. Girl a dagger and them things. Them. I said, I have never seen. Tifa, you know, say a girl who can read and write. You must I mean, I like when you act like a fool fool. Remember, say, Tifa, me say, you have never shown any signs of that kind of behavior. Even if you were a lesbian, or you do girls, you have never shown any signs of that publicly, ever. You have never given me a reason to think that. So where you go sue, me say? Where you go sue, me say? <laughs> yeah. You know if I just realized that you are, have to go go live and talk some things, and then the newspaper got set foot on Tifa going at it, the whole of the black of them got set foot on Tifa going at it, and all these things, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I don't know if you go viral, Tifa, but guess what? You still go low. Should not take that book in. You see me? You shouldn't take that book in there. You just... You just destroy your whole character, like your whole demeanor where people have fear. 